All right, so it's a uh, it's a giant robotic arm. It's got uh, three steppers in it that uh, control the the X, the Y, and the Z axis. So it goes up, it goes out, and the uh, the claw goes in and out. One of the the developers upstairs in R and D uh, came up with a Bluetooth stack that interfaced to the Wiimote and turned it into a bunch of really nice, neatly written VIs. So from there, I was able to integrate the Wiimote into LabVIEW, and from there, I was able to control the robotic arm with the Wiimote. This VI that I wrote, uh, it controls the stepper motors in velocity mode, and it takes inputs from the Wiimote. So if I pressed up, the arm goes up, and if I press left, the arm goes left. But the beauty of LabVIEW and the parallelism of the, uh, the control loops is that if I want to go up and left, that's pretty easy too. I just press up and left on the, the control. So as a little side project, I uh, picked, the, uh, picked the arm up and uh, started interfacing it with our new hardware. So now I'm driving the stepper motors with one of our stepper motor drives and using one of our stepper motor controllers, the uh, PCI 7354, to uh, control the stepper motors. And then I'm using LabVIEW to, uh, to control the interface. And uh, the Wiimote is what actually uh, provides the control. The robotic arm was a side project I picked up about two months ago and it took me a Friday afternoon to get it up and going with LabVIEW and just telling it to go to program positions and then later on I decided I'd turn it into a demo and a couple of hours is all I've spent on the uh, the Wiimote part of it. The Wiimote VIs that the developer made those are actually on our forums you can search for them and it's in, it's in a zip file, so you can download all of the VIs that I have. And then I just use standard motion controls, so it's entirely possible to do something. The only requirement is that you have a gigantic robotic arm sitting on your desk that's not being used. My name is Evan Dozier. I'm an applications engineer, and uh, this is my giant robotic arm.